Okay, Parshas Titzaveh. Parshas Titzaveh. Let's begin with a short vart from the Hilga Drash. Moshe, Moshe Feinstein has an absolutely, you know, some things are just like perfect, beautiful, beautiful to the point, nice and sweet. The Pasuk says, V'hoya ha-mizbeach, hoidash ha-kadoshim. And what's fascinating is we had two Mizbechois. We had the Mizbeach Hanechoshas and the Mizbeach Hazov. The Mizbeach Hazov was inside. The Mizbeach Hanechoshas was outside. I don't pardon? Okay. <laughs> that was awkward. Mizbeach Hazov was inside. The Mizbeach Hanechoshas was outside. What's fascinating is that the Torah is referencing the Mizbeach Hanechoshas, the outside Mizbeach, when the Pasik of Tesla Mizayin says it's Kodesh HaKadoshim. So as the Ramayi Shafayin said, understand, if you're going to call either of them Mizbechais Kodesh HaKadoshim, Holy of Holies, it's the one that's inside the base of Mikdash. Why is the Pasik calling the one outside Kodesh HaKadoshim? Says Ramayi an absolutely beautiful vart that, you know, usually we would say anyone in the base of Mikdash has to hear, but we'll say that anyone that probably is listening to the vart of Ramayi it's relevant to them. Says Ramayisha, those that are inside the base of Migdash, those that are Kaidesh in the base of Migdash, who's Kaidesh in the base of Migdash? He who's learning Taira, he who's connected to Taira. We could say Talmud Chacham, and we could apply it to each and every person. If you're in the base of Medrash, if you're in the Shul, if you're listening to the Shia, if you're reading the words of Ramayisha, then you're Kaidesh inside the base of Medrash, inside the base of Migdash. Teaches the Torah when you go outside, when you're outside the base of Migdash, you know you now have to act. You now have the responsibility to be Kodesh Hakodashim. Because when people see you, when people see people who learn Torah that are connected to Torah that are connected to the base of Migdash inside, when you go outside, you have to be that much more careful to ensure that you're perceived as Kodesh Hakodashim. An absolutely incredible lesson is something we have to remind ourselves. It's maybe a difficult weight that we walk around carrying that anyone, any Jew, any person, especially in the world of anti-Semitism, we don't have to go any further. Just anyone with a yarmulke on your head, you're representing something. But even more so, he who davens, he who learns, he's really connected. His responsibility is that much greater. So he says, Ramayisha, that is Kaidesh inside the Beis HaMikdash. Be careful. You have to be Kaidesh HaKadoshim. Every action, every word, every nuance could be simply sitting in shul. And you, what do you want to do? You just want to mind your own business. You want, you want to fall asleep on top of the safer. You want to space out during davening. Because, you know, whatever. Be careful. You are being looked at as the Kaidesh HaKadoshim. Because you are one that is connected to Torah. Because you are the Kaidesh inside the Beis HaMedrash. So then outside, you have to be that much more careful how everyone perceives you. A little bit far in the button. One second.